Okay, so we did that. Okay, so now we can go in here and, and do other stuff. I guess. That was fun. It's up there, is it? It's in here, right? Or not? Not here. No, we go up. That's where all those computers were that were like, you need to reset the mainframe or whatever. Alright, so what, what are we looking at here? Um. Scans. Okay. So, what are, we, what are we supposed to do here? What do I have this? Copy to none. Restricted file. Okay, well, yeah, I know there's no. Where do we put it? Put it in this thing, right? Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Okay, so we just need to get somebody's scan in there. Right? No? Not those? Not those people? This person never died. Guy guy never died. Or or Imogen read. Oh. Copy the chip? Corrupted data, uh, copy the chip. I don't know. Agreeable exterior test. Chip already contains this file. What was that? Oh, oh, okay, I see, I see. I don't understand, like, what that was about. Okay, good. We did it. We got something on there. I'm not really clear on what we're doing. Uh, do we maybe... No, we can't with this. It doesn't have... The receptacle that we need. We should really look for a scan. I know. Check the storage. I, that's what I'm doing. All right, all right. Sheesh. Okay, wait. I guess it would have to be this one. Okay, okay. What do you mean? Containing scan data. So I gotta do, I gotta do something here first? Scheduled scans. John Strohmeyer, Jane Adams. These people never got scanned though. Including Joaquin Dufresne. I don't know. Look at this, look at this little webcam, it's so cute. All right, um. What do? So can't, I can't do this for some reason, I don't understand why. I was thinking, with all the people scanned for the arc, someone must have had access to the dumb bat. If you find a scan of someone who knew the security cipher, maybe we can extract it somehow. Extract from what? What exactly am I looking for? Look for the large racks of data chips in the storage next to my lab. Should be plenty to choose from. Oh, that's where I'm supposed to go. Why am I trying to go through the window when the door is wide open? Golly. A freaking moron. All right. You guys are like, no argument there. I would have known exactly what to do immediately. All right, let's see. Your lab is up here, <laughs> right? Okay. Large racks of data chips. Not these, I'm guessing. Large racks of data chips. So not these, right? Okay, wait, I, I think I know where to go. This isn't even her lab, this is her lab. So, in here? How do I, how do I do? Ah, uh, okay, yeah, sure. Bust. Bust, okay. That one? Damaged. All right, then. These all look bad. Broken. Aha! Look, there's a, there's a good one there. Yes! An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Okay, this is what I'm supposed to do. Got it. There should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Dude. Robin, right? Oh, what did it say there? I didn't even see it. 
No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Another fucking continuity suicide. Strohmeyer locked me out of my lab again. Delta Refugee, Construct Wrangler, he's working for Strohmeyer now, not that guy. Kill himself because of continuity? Strohmeyer is really mad, has tightened security, Ark project on hold. Said she'd help out delivering the Ark. We look so much alike. In a different life, I'm sure we'd be best friends. She helped me cut the wave leak from the helmet. If anything, it should make the post-scan hangover less severe. Strasky was cheerful and funny as always. Said she helped construct the Ark, but not carry it to Phi. Okay, I don't know who these people are. I know that there's like a list of staff. We'll just we'll just try uploading. Oh. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Stromar. Kronstadt. Okay, well maybe there's another one. There's another chip that works. Okay, I guess we can just look and we'll be able to identify on site if they work or not. I don't see any other ones that work. These seem to all be busted. Honestly. Okay. I already threw those out. Alright, let's do one more time. Yeah, nothing there. Okay, so there's really only- this is the chip. I'm just gonna hit upload on every one until it works. And if it doesn't, then I don't know what to do. No, I don't think so. Stromai recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher, if you can find one of them. Somebody from... Not Mark, right? Okay, try actually reading the info and then pick one. Whoa! Catherine's getting sassy! He's working for Strohmeyer. So this guy? But he's a wrangler. That sounds like... something physical. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. Alright, fine. I'm an idiot. Fine. Fine. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Right. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Don't be afraid. Chun? What happened to me? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. There's no need to worry. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Well, why are, you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away. We gotta upload a, an environment. Work. Maybe we can try again. We gotta upload an environment, dude. Yeah. Okay, let's put him in the beach. Now, scan room. Okay, let's try it again. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up. Bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. No, it's okay, I promise. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, WoW. You hear me? You won't break me! Damn, okay, never Do we mind. Need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Well, I don't know what the support module is. I don't have options for that. Let's put him in the ski lodge. Like, how would he not know that that's fake, right? That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What is this? Where am I? Relax, Mr. Wan. Just keep calm. Dr. Chun? 
What the hell is this place? I don't have time to explain. I need you to give me the new security cipher. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. It's not for me. I'm trying to save the Ark. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Charo. Punch your teeth in! I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. Well, we need to think this through. We need some more data. That's what the scan room was supposed to be. Fine. We'll go try to get some more. I wish I knew Brandon better. What would make him talk? Well, Alice being there would help. But I don't know where we get her scan. Um... I don't know, maybe there's... Have we even been in his room? Here we go, Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Well, I didn't know you could do that! Ah, I would have come straight here! If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. All right. Let's see. Right there he is with his parents, I guess. There he is with the girl. Maybe Alice. Cute. Okay, Anchor has finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Cryer, and I moved into Theta today. Anchor said he'd stick around for a while longer, that crazy bastard. I took pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. Did my arc scan together with Alice. Brandon mentions a girl named Alice. They did their scans together. Alice Coster? We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. Might make him talk. Not sure how, though. Keep looking. Strohmeyer told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. I was fine at first, but got a splitting headache a couple of hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun girl. She is so fucking uncomfortable at all times, it makes my skin crawl. Really? Hmm. Strohmeyer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently Conrad wanted in on the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. Just heard that the Komorebi survey team is going to Delta and pick up Acres. He's been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Ah, eh, well, eh. nothing good. Brandon, I'm really a mess about the scan. Everyone is being so brave. All smiles, no regrets. You know how you said you would hold my hand during the scan? If the offer still stands, I gratefully accept. If we do it together, we could suffer the hangover together as well. They say it takes a couple of days to recover. Kisses, Alice. Alice and Brandon were definitely an item. Good. Then we should find a way to incorporate her into the scan. All right, we'll try. Yeah, there you are, Brandon. Ooh, look at that glossy. Glossy gloss, I love it. It says pathos too. All right, he was born in Hong Kong, Chinese. There since 2012. Oh, sorry. 2102. Okay. Um, let's see. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Stratsky and Alvaro to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great, this is exactly what we need. I think we've got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. This, definitely feeling good about this. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. I don't like this. This is... This is weird. Sorry, I overshot it. Um, yeah, I don't... I don't fucking like this, the man. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathway already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent the whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? 
Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. Truly sentient machines, thinking they are people, is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Yeah, I think Catherine, she's too dedicated to this arc thing. Like, she is, there's something dark there about her, if you ask me. Like, I think at some point she's gonna get desperate enough to do something crazy. All right, so if we have Alice in the scan room, this should work. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Stromer. He's sending me to the new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Chum just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel I'm over. Okay. It's 1729 over 42. 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. Luan. Brandon. Goodbye. No, wait. That's I... enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. Simon, we got it. We can get to the dumbat now. Get back here. Oh, sounds like sounds like you made the decision immediately after you said you were. I needed to figure out what we used the data for. All right. Um. So good, we got the cipher. Yeah, this like opens up a whole new realm of possibilities, though. I, I feel like there's gonna be some sort of Bioshocky twist at some point, but I don't know. Like the game's already very similar to Bioshock, you know. It like thematically, I mean. There you are. Just warming up the Dunbat for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. It's in quarantine, though. Like, what does that mean? Okay, that's it. That's everything. Let's go ahead and... Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the Abyss. Sounds easy enough. Oh, perfect. I can't wait to go to the Abyss! Okay. Excuse me. Oh! I, <laughs> I was waiting for that bulkhead to open up. I guess not. I mean, you, you can really tell that the uh, composer is the same as the one for Amnesia. Now? Uh, do the thing? Now? You don't want to move, huh? Alright, uh, we'll just have to see... What are you connected to? You're not connected to anything. Oh! We need to be plugged in, clearly. There. All right, good. Uh, do the thing. Do that thing, no? No? Yeah, do the thing. What happened? Who was that? What did he mean? Doesn't work anymore. So 
it didn't work, huh? Um, do we go back and plug her in? What is this? Oh, I need to, okay. Makes a lot more sense. Uh, do I go back out here? No, it's, bulkhead's closed, okay. Yeah. Eh, I don't want to get hurt again. I'm already kind of hurt. There we go. I don't know why I didn't just move it taut against the wall the first time. Oh, perfect. <laughs> what happened? I got an achievement called Plan B. So this is, it like, is there a Plan A route? And I just messed it up? Maybe? High security area. Okay, I'm not allowed to I'm not allowed to hang out there. That's fine, man. That's fine. I understand. something close? Is there something in the vents? I don't like what's happening out there. Where is this? Where are you taking me? What is this? Oh good. Crap, I gotta fist it. I wonder if... There's probably some effect from doing that too many times. Yeah, sure, let's do it. Well, it was talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The Dunbat was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, we can't quit now. There's gotta be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the Climber in Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the Abyss. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah, okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. All right, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the arc. Ooh, that would be useful. You didn't right. know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? <laughs> Catherine. Making promises, huh? She seems so manipulative. Like, I feel like she's manipulating me. Or Simon, rather. Start an arc simulation. I want to see how it works. Okay. Sure. I've decided to finalize the arc with the scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you who wanted to go, but didn't get a chance to scan yourself before the project was put on hold. It's been two months since I've had a scan. I don't see how I'll ever be able to win back the support you all showed when we started the project. I'm sorry. I never meant for anyone to take their lives. It was never my intention to fool anyone. I just wanted to save something. Dr. Catherine Chun. Ride the climber into the abyss, regroup at Tau, head to launch site, load the bullet, launch arc. 
Okay, so this is what we need to do. <laughs> okay. Right, yeah, we know that, the, that it's there. Recently it's decided that the art project would become Pathos 2's last official commitment. The staff has been urged to carry on with their duties despite Earth's catastrophic condition. I think the ARC project is the most logical step forwards, sorry, step towards saving mankind and that we should spend as much time and resources as needed to complete it. Agree. So a couple of videos ago I took a survey and a lot of people uh, commented that I, it wasn't what I thought it was because I thought that somebody else had took it and we were looking at their answers, but I don't know. Uh, I, that seems kind of weird to me if if that was how you select things when like this is completely different from that. Anyway, whatever. To embark, every passenger needs to be flushed with electromagnetism using a pilot seat. These scanning sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches, sometimes lasting up to three days. I think temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to save mankind. Okay. No matter how severe. I guess I agree. The Ark is built to fit a Ranger MK-7 probe, meaning it could be shot into space with the Omega Space Gun and technically survive for thousands of years, living off the light from our sun and distant stars. I think the Ark should leave Earth behind and be launched into space. I guess. The digitalization of humanity, oof, I don't like that, is an opportunity to make a quantum leap in our own evolution. The people inside the Ark will, out of necessity, be generated from existing genetic code but could be altered to allow for cosmetic changes, ease aging, and even prevent death. I think we are at risk of losing our humanity if we were to rid ourselves of disease and our mortality. I, I, I kind of disagree with that. There are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the Ark. Shit. A way to diversify and expand the population would be to introduce artificial intelligences that would be in every way, and in every way appear to be human, but with childlike and naive sensibilities. As we continue to explore the nature of intelligence, we may find a way to make them smarter in the future. I think even an inferior group of artificial people would benefit our society. Ah, so you're talking about like, so they're artificial intelligences. So you would be creating people. I fucking disagree with that. Thank you for participating. Here's how your colleagues voted. Interesting. Nobody strongly disagreed with pain for gain. I agreed with it. Artificial evolution. I, I said disagree. And so I, I said disagree to inferior companions. And most people hit strongly disagree. Interesting. Strongly agree. Right there. Yeah. Strongly agree. That's interesting. You can kind of see like the descent into like darker subject matter. And the strongly disagree goes up. Huh. Okay. Well, good. Okay, lots of reading. Lots of reading. Sorry, guys. I know that, uh... That's five, all right. Quick stop at Omicron, then Tau, then five. Let's we, do it. We had a lot of, like, action early on, right? Wow, hey. that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. Damn. Well, that's true. <laughs> that was kind of a dick thing to say, Simon. Okay. Power suit. Proper usage for the safety of you and your colleagues. Don't hold your breath. Don't stay out too long. Don't dive too deep. Don't dive with malfunctioning equipment. Alright. So, we gotta check it for visual damages. Starting with the legs. Okay. Work yourself upwards, lock all the pieces together, let a partner help you with the back piece, tap the secure button. Should hear the suit seal itself. The suit will then start to equalize pressure. If the suit doesn't seal itself, flex the shock absorbers and try again. If it still doesn't work, do not try to fix it yourself. Well, we don't really have a choice, do we? Prep arc with trans signal transmitter. Power packs, tools, extra oxygen, P2 permissions. What the hell is this? Thanks for the codes, I guess. So what is this? I don't have the Omni tool. 
Can't use it yet. How do I load up the arc? Do I just go up here and, and hit this? What's this thing? That's just a compound examiner. Coster uses it to investigate structural integrity and payload frameworks. Of course. Could you fit inside it? If I knew what you were made of, it would be a hell of a lot easier to figure out how to get you on the arc. Well, I'll give it a try. Fuck it, right? At this point, who cares? I'm sure this will be pleasant. Bit oh, of a God. tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Yeah, it's right here. Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Oh my god. Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's what? disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Anyway, the Cortex chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. That's so weird! At least we know how to get on the arc. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the specifics. I really wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated and processed. Man, so I'm a... I'm a woman. <laughs> 